Ooh. Oh, she wants to strike every second. Hey, good morning, everybody. It's 4.30 in the morning. I'm in Dallas, Texas. Welcome to the Vlog 666. So I'm back at the airport. I tell you what, I've been excited about this day for the last couple months. Cannot wait to share with you what happened. But that's back at BHB. So uh, the truth is, we need to get back to BHB right now. And I am back here at the shop, and I cannot wait to show you this. And by this, I mean this. Take a look, Lucy is wrapped around a huge clutch of eggs. That's right, a couple days ago, Kelsey actually sent me pictures, and Eric and Mary were going back and forth with us. Guys, I'm really excited to share you with this, but we just realized Lucy is laying her eggs. Literally right this second. And I said, let's not pull them as long as she coils around them really good, which she certainly has. I said, let's wait till I get home. You can see four eggs. It looks like she's pushing another out right now. Can you see that way back there? Just by happenstance, it turned out to be on vlog 666. Now, of course, this is Lucy. If you guys didn't know, her name is Lucy because it's short for Lucifer. So how ironic is that, that I'm gonna pull this girl's clutch of eggs on 666. Not disturbing her because we're waiting for Brian to cut back before we actually collect them, but it looks like she's still nice and tight on there, keeping them all covered, so that's a good thing. I know when we saw when she was laying them, there's definitely good eggs in there, so uh, I think actually everybody at the shop has odds on uh, guessing the correct number of eggs, so we'll see after Brian gets back and collects them who actually wins. Um, I think it's a really big pot. I think it's like around six bucks because everybody like did a dollar. <laughs> so, so you guys can go ahead and you can comment and guess on this one how many eggs you think she has. Once the actual unveiling comes out, we'll see how many of you guys are correct too and see who the big winner here at BHB is. I think the odds are in my favor because I've witnessed way more large clutches being laid, uh, but you never know. I mean, it's a big pot six bucks, so I'm hoping I'm the winner. Regardless, guys, she is fired up. Now, I'm gonna be totally honest with you. When you're pulling a big python like hers eggs, typically right after they lay, they're a little wore out, so you can kind of get them off the eggs. She's had two days to rest up. She is definitely gonna be a handful. Let's just go ahead and jump in here, but not before we ask the crew how many eggs they think she actually has. How many eggs do you think Lucy has? I'm guessing 60. 65. 72 two slugs. About 57. 83. 80. 50. I'm gonna go low on this one. I'm gonna say 43 eggs. All right, so here's the deal, guys. I have a roll of paper towel just to kind of protect myself a little bit. And listen, if she bites this paper towel, it's not gonna hurt her at all. I mean, it's totally squishy. I prefer her not to bite it, but I really would rather her bite the paper towel than my face or my hand, right? So I've got a snake hook. I've got this guys here are here as backup. So I'll probably hand them the eggs so I can really concentrate on Lucy. So let's just jump right into this. Lucy? You okay, girl? Okay? Oh, boy. She's really holding my bags off. Woo! Okay. You're all right, girl. You're okay. You're okay. Okay, okay, okay. Ooh, I don't know how I'm gonna do this. It's gonna be fun. Woo! Oh, she wants to strike every second. Ow! Woo! That I don't want that to be my hand. Look at look what yeah, she did to that. Boring. That would have been messed up. Look! Okay, girl. Come on, girl. Oh, she is fired up! I'm not 100% sure what I'm going to do here, guys. That's a lot of eggs. I think I might have to literally try to somehow get her off her eggs. She is protecting them. The biggest thing is here, I don't want her to hurt her eggs either. So 
I have to do this thing where I get her off, but yet I don't want her to. She's just so focused on me. It's hard to get her to do anything. She's just so upset. Oh, oh gosh, so bad. Uh oh, now I've lost my hook. Woo! This is crazy! Alright, I'm starting I'm, I'm starting to get anxious to get this done now. Here. Keeper, watch out, watch out, watch out, let it go, 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 let it go. Alright, right here, right here, right here, right here, right here. Right here. Kelsey, I don't want you. Get him! Watch it, watch it, watch Mary. Yeah, Kelsey, she would come back on you. Like, she's not the normal Lucy, where you can, like, get her once she's moving. <laughs> okay, good. Good, 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 good. And a couple more. Eric, did you say two? Yeah, he did! did. Oh, <laughs> no way! No you're way. right on the number! Oh, oh no way. Way. I don't feel it! Like Eric, are you I kidding me? I synced up with her! I synced up with her! Sometimes you just know. I feel like you're gonna get the exact number now. I think you keep Hang on, hang on, hang on. Alright guys, so we got the eggs. No one got bit. She was definitely fired up. We definitely are going to have to give her a day or so to calm down. Her cage needs to be cleaned. But holy moly, she gave me a run for my money. Now it's time to count the eggs and see who won this challenge. I think it's me. <laughs> 72 eggs and two slugs. Well, he's two got slugs. the two slugs. He ain't got the 72. So let's go ahead and count these things. Okay, so we've got two slugs here. We've got two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 19, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 32, 34, 36, 38, 40, 42, 44, 46, 48, 50, 52, 53, and 54. So 54 eggs, two slugs. Who is closest? Who, I think? I guess 57. Uh, Jessica, I think it was, but yeah, but wasn't it like the low, if you go over, it goes back to the lowest? Nah, nah. <laughs> I was just trying to steal the victory, guys. Okay, so there you have it. What was it? 54? 54, two slugs. So really it was 56, so you were really close. Yeah, You're yeah. within one. That is awesome. Whew. That gets your adrenaline going, guys. I gotta be honest with you, but how awesome is that? Look at that beautiful clutch of eggs. Can you imagine Kelsey when they, those little babies play with daddy? I'm so excited. <laughs> I know, oh my gosh. All right, guys, we're gonna go ahead and get these guys separated, get them in an incubator box, and uh, hey, you know, it takes about 70 to 80 days for retics to typically hatch, and oh, we're gonna have a whole bunch of little squirmy guys. Now, we are gonna be looking for people that are specifically able to take care of big snakes. We're not just gonna sell these to anyone, so if you guys are interested, hit us up. We'll go from there. As for now, that's vlog 666. Just a quick break from the vlog. I'm not gonna lie, I was watching that footage and uh, I'll be honest with you, I'm out of practice. You know, years and years ago, I bred Burmese and reticulated pythons, even African rock pythons, and I was much better at taking away eggs. I mean, when I watched that footage, I thought, wow, I look like an amateur because that definitely wasn't the best big snake egg extraction that I've ever seen. But hey, it's been probably seven or eight years since I've actually had a big clutch and probably 12 or 13 years since I've really had multiple clutches of big snakes. So, uh, although I looked a little amateurish, trust me, it's not that easy. And when you haven't done it often, it becomes pretty intimidating. Uh, Lucy is doing really great. It's the next day. She's calmed down. We've got her cage cleaned up. Uh, we're gonna get her some food later this week, and I think she's gonna get really beat back up, ready for her move over to the reptarium. But I tell you what, that was awesome. I cannot believe 54 good eggs. I mean, wow, that is amazing. I'm so excited when these guys hatch. Now the problem is, is I'm not really super up on retic marks, so when I'm hatching, all these different combinations. I'm gonna probably have to call my buddy Jay over at Prehistoric just to figure out what I'm hatching, but uh, that's still 70 or 80 days away. All right, so now that the adrenaline is kind of calmed down from removing Lucy from her eggs, we have a slightly smaller python to remove. What do we have, Kelsey? We have a black pastel head ghost ball python bred to a pastel mimosa. Beautiful, that's nice. Oh, look at that. Great clutch of eggs, look at that. Not bad. 
It's certainly not 53 eggs, but uh, <laughs> that's, it's, that's a beautiful clutch of ball pythons right there. Look so much that. easier. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, no drama there. No drama. It's a good way to go for sure. Oh my gosh, how many eggs do we have yeah, in there? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine? Nine eggs. Not bad. Nine eggs. That's a really good clutch. So uh, that is going to wrap up our day for collecting python eggs. That was absolutely awesome. And I'm glad that we ended it with some ball pythons. Good job, Kelsey. Guys, do me a favor really quick. Noah was actually vlogging, right, while we were pulling those eggs? Of course. Different angle. I'm going to put a link in the description. Got to check that out because, again, you know, that was pretty crazy, right? That was really cool. Words can't explain. It was great. And, and he was really afraid. Like, he was filming, oh, and yeah. he was freaking out because the snake kept on lunging out at him while he was filming so definitely check that video out again link in the description show him some love please and with that said guys i don't know how else to end the vlog other than to just end it right there because that was absolutely incredible i hope that you guys enjoyed vlog 666 thank god we have that behind us i tell you what i've been thinking about that for a while and it worked out kind of crazy with lucy of course lucifer laying a clutch of eggs how crazy is that and i hope that you enjoyed it you guys have an absolutely amazing day thank you for all your support i love you guys so much. Can you do me a couple favors before we get out of here? Smash that like button for pulling Lucy's eggs. Hey, that was a little bit dangerous. Make sure to turn those post notifications on. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about pulling those eggs. Always be kind to someone, and I promise I'm going to see you guys tomorrow. Yeah.